Mechanically attached system. Mechanically attached roofing systems provide a lightweight and easy to maintain roofing system. This system is able to accommodate irregular roof configurations on a variety of roof decks. Weatherbond RBR reinforced EPDM membranes offer building owners additional peace of mind with their increased durability and available puncture warranties. In a mechanically attached roofing system, the insulation is mechanically attached to the roof structure with Weatherbond fastening plates and appropriate Weatherbond fasteners. Then the membrane is also mechanically attached to the roof structure using HPW fasteners and plates. This system uses Weatherbond RBR reinforced EPDM membrane. The mechanically attached roofing system is able to accommodate roof slopes up to 18 inches and 12 and can be installed on roof buildings up to 75 feet in height. The mechanically attached roofing system begins with the installation of an approved substrate. Insulation is affixed to the roof deck by using Weatherbond plates and fasteners. When fastening the insulation, follow the appropriate weather bond specification. Only install the amount of insulation that can be covered by membrane in the same day. Remove any debris from the roof deck. Place the insulation on the deck. It is good practice to stagger the joints of the insulation. By doing this, the amount of thermal loss between the insulation boards is reduced. Insulation must be butted together with no gaps greater than a quarter inch. Follow the Weatherbond approved fastening pattern. The typical pattern for a mechanically attached roofing system is one fastener for every eight square feet on a four foot by eight foot insulation board. On a four foot by four foot insulation board, place two fasteners in opposing corners, approximately 12 inches from the two sides. Install the plates and fasteners using a screw gun ensuring that the plate is tight to the insulation without overdriving the fastener. Continue this procedure until all insulation is fastened to the roof deck. For the required perimeter securement, position the 9 inch wide peel and stick reinforced perimeter strip, peel and stick RPS, at the perimeter of the roof between 42 and 54 inches from the edge of the roof. Fasten the RPS with the required Weatherbond plates and fasteners. These plates are positioned in the center of the strip and fastened either 6 or 12 inches on center. In the field of the roof, position the membrane over the substrate. This roll could be 8 or 12 feet wide depending on design requirements. Utilizing the pre-printed blue line on one edge of the sheet, install all of the required fasteners. The type of fastener and plate used will depend upon the type of deck. The fasteners must be installed directly over the pre-printed blue line, achieving a minimum 3 inch wide splice from the center of the plate. End lap splices are set at a minimum of 3 inches. No mechanical securement is required at these locations. The sheets are typically fastened a maximum of 12 inches on center. After the sheet has been fastened in place, Position the next roll of membrane overlapping the adjoining sheet to achieve a 6 inch wide minimum splice. Pull back the membrane and expose the peel and stick seam tape. Apply primer to the underside of the membrane where the peel and stick seam tape will meet the membrane. Once the primer is tacked off, peel the poly back off the peel and stick seam tape. Roll the membrane at the seam area. Refer to the Weatherbond Seam Splice in Common Detail video for detailed instructions on completing splices. There are three details which require additional membrane securement. The pre-molded pipe seal, the field fabricated pipe seal, and the peel and stick pourable sealer pockets. These three details require the use of a 12 inch seam fastening plate located no more than 12 inches from the detail. Round penetrations less than 6 inches in diameter only require 4 fasteners and plates. For pipes over 6 inches in diameter, seam fastening plates must be spaced 12 inches away and 12 inches on center from the penetration. Secure the 2 inch seam fastening plate to the substrate. Apply Weatherbond EPDM primer to the membrane surface and overlay the plates with peel and stick cover strip 